Where's Daniel? Daniel's inside getting a sandwich. <laughs> What's up chaps, this kids is back and right about now. We've got a brand new video for you. My name's Gids. This is your boy Smash. I'm Smash. And this is Gids. But a boom. I realise I've just got one ear out. Yeah. But a boom. It's a good look that mate. It's a really good look. I'm sure the people will agree it's a really good look. Yeah boy. So today anyway, we're eating brownies. I've already ate mine. Well, that's not the video, of course. The video is this beautiful weapon which we are cruising about. So today we're driving about in a uh, old school Land Rover Discovery. It's from, from the the uh, Essex Boys era. Everyone's seen the film Essex Boys. Or heard of it. What? Or heard of it. Or heard of it. <laughs> For the brownie. It's done 168,712 miles. <laughs> so it's quite wallowy, if you like. Wobbly. As in it wobbles all over the place. Blowers don't really work properly. So no. I'm having to I've got two windows down to keep us from steaming up entirely. Yeah. So it's a wire edge Land Rover Discovery. It's got well it had 135 brake horsepower when it came out of the factory. 168,000 miles later, I doubt it'll have the same oh. amount of horsepower if I'm honest. Um, not. When it we knew we had a top speed of 98 miles per hour. It's a 2.5 diesel engine and it produces 220 foot pound of torque. Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. It's not warm when she's away. Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. And she's always gone too long Anytime she goes away Just to remind people, if they would like to hire Mr Gitchum to sing at the wedding or any kind of event Slide into his DMs Slide into the DMs I am... I am... Uh, giant I have a, a giant <laughs> I have availability for um, performances, let's say I don't know why I have availability, I'm a very good performer. Yeah, so it's a 2.5 turbo diesel Land Rover Discovery on a wire edge. It's got an automatic gearbox, which, to be fair, <coughs> there's no bangs or the clutch isn't slipping or anything like that. I mean, they were built to last, really, weren't they? The mechanics yeah. were built to last. There you go. The, there we go. It's, it's basically just a big lump. Well to the tunnel. I mean, if you look at how discoveries have come on, come on since it, since it first came out, and obviously this is a wire edge, and now we're on, what's 19 plate? Yeah. Um, you look at today's discovery, and compared to this discovery, there is a massive difference. A massive difference. This is a... This is a seven seat version. Um, it is quite, do you know what, for, for a Land Rover, I was gonna say it's quite spacious, but it's not really. It might look it on the camera, but we've got a wide angle lens on there, so you can see the entirety of us. But, to be fair, at the same time I am chilled. You are chilled, but the driving position is shocking. Yeah. Oh, actually though, it's small back there. Yeah. The driving position is, is sh like, this side of me, it's really cramped near the door um, and everything down this side is really cramped ah. so the driving position is really really shocking like I'm turning the steering wheel and the elbow on this side is just constantly battling against the door 
So it's not a comfortable drive, guys. Not particularly. Not particularly. I mean, if you're a really if small a person, a really small person, then you might be all right. But yeah. seeing as we are of larger mass, <laughs> then it's not, see, all muscle, obviously. Um, yeah, obviously, yeah. The performance is terrible. <laughs> Let's just put that out there. <laughs> the performance is terrible. You put your foot down, it doesn't really do a lot. I can, um, I can see my breath in this car. Let's have a look. What we're doing now, we are doing 21 miles per hour. And we got up to 32. Whoa. In that space of time, we got up to 32 miles per hour. There you go. It's a lovely vehicle. It's not. It might have been in its day, obviously. So why register what's that? 2000, 2001? Um, so it might have been a lovely vehicle when it were, when it were, when it were new. But it's tired now. Yeah. It's very tired now. There's another one that looks in better condition than this. That's an 03 plate. No, we're not going to attempt to get out there because it, it, it ain't the most sprightly of vehicles. <laughs> it takes you 12 hours just to pull out. Exactly. Nice, it does. Wow. <laughs> it does. <laughs> <laughs> if you've got like your own off-road track or you know some off-road tracks that you can go on, yeah. then this might be the vehicle for you because obviously it's, it's it's a very old car, it's not it's not something you're gonna be that too bothered about. You can get them for cheap enough these days, you can pick them up for a grand and less. Yeah. Um so if you've got a track that you can have a bit of fun on, then by all means. Have it! I'm not sure if there's something wrong with this. Because I'll put my foot down and it takes like six seconds to actually engage something, do something. Maybe it's just slow like that. Maybe. Maybe. So as far as inside goes, um, you've got you've got selector for changing between your low and high gears, obviously for when you're off-road and etc etc. You've got a radio, you've got a clock, you've got, I think it has actually got air con this you know. It's got some sort of air system, which doesn't get hot by the way. It's got this, something. This thing does not get warm. Um, Which is kind of why I'm wrapped all up, you know. <laughs> it's, quite, it's quite nippy. Pretty cool, mate. Oh, that sounds nice. SL65 AMG. Hello. But a boom. We're not going to waste too much time on this video because it's just an old Land Rover. We just thought yeah. we'd show, show you it for the laugh. Yeah, for the laugh of, and to show you what we're driving around in this morning. This beautiful morning. This beautiful English cold, rainy morning. Yeah. Um, it is actually 9.16. Oh, so it's 8, it's 9.17 now. It's not 9.16. The real time is, oh, it's actually 11 minutes past 12 now. Afternoon, so I do apologise. Afternoon, yeah. When you buy one of these, you even get some free sunglasses. Yeah. I think you're being greedy. Greedy? Yeah, let me have one. Okay. There you go, mate. Oh, don't you look at Bobby Dazzler. That's how you do it, isn't it? You put it over your hood. <laughs> Trust me. You got this, Matt. You got this. So, yeah, that's how you do it. You even get some free shades like this when you get a vehicle like this. Beautiful landing. Beautiful old wire edge. Beautiful speed. Beautiful glasses. What's not beautiful about it? The performance, that's what's not beautiful. The performance <laughs> is horrendous. Horrendous. So yeah, what we want to do in this video as well, get some footage of the outside and show you guys. The outside, get, get some footage of the outside, mate. Some you know footage for the outside and show you guys. So that's what we're going to do now. If you put a London accent in, in my, nah, not now, nah. That's what we're going to do now. Nah. You get it, son. We're from Yorkshire. Not Landon. <laughs> Not Landon. Not Landon. From bloody Yorkshire. From bloody Yorkshire. I can't even put a Yorkshire accent. That wasn't a Yorkshire accent either. I can't even put a, a Yorkshire accent. <laughs> I'm speaking more Yorkshire than speaking normal. But yeah, we're going to show you... Does that know what we're going to do now, right? Right, we're now... We're going to get out and we're going to take some footage outside at Wagon Lake. There we go. Footy fun out motorway and all that lot. <laughs> Forty fun out motorway. There we go. Put chairs in the oven and put wood in the toil. But a boom. <laughs> I think we've got to start very bonkers. We're like. proper. <laughs> we're proper like dippy Yorkshiremen, us, aren't we? Yeah.
Or just proper just Yorkshire man. Hello! Hi! Yeah, we're not gonna drag this <laughs> video out any longer than it needs to be. Um I mean it's a it's a classic Land Rover Discovery. Yeah it is. It's a wire edge, probably 2000, 2001 ish it's done 168,717 miles, you can tell. You can tell. And you could have a lot of fun with this off-road. Yeah, definitely. Um, so if you've got some kind of a track or some kind of unused land that you can use and you want a bit of fun, you can pick these up for a grand and less. So why not? Get one of these and rag it about! Obviously, within the law and safely and always oh, yeah. wear a seatbelt. Um, and on your own land as well. On your own land. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. Obviously. Yeah. But yeah, this is episode number six. Yes, that's correct. We are going to see you in episode number seven, which could be anything. Probably another vehicle. Yeah. Or it could be on a business. Who knows? 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 Yeah. As usual, it's like a script, it's like a robot, but as usual, give us a like, give us a thumbs up, give us a share, because everyone loves a share, hit that subscribe button, which I've got the camera in a different position now, so I'm not sure where it is. is it down here? No, it's down here. Down there. Yep. Hit that subscribe button, which is down there. Yeah. Hit the little alarm bell so it notifies you every time one of our videos goes live. There you go. Give us a follow on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, SoundCloud, because our new mixtape has just dropped as well. Unleash the Beast. Uh, so, yeah, it was up on everywhere. Smashing kids everywhere. And as usual, it's on the bottom of your screen down here. Smashing kids. That's it. Boom! See you later, chaps.